Hey, welcome to 3D Guilty with me. Come, come, come back again. Now we're gonna show you another tutorial. My new tutorial is an alien head for XAA games. You can see a box. Six boxes have in every segment two. Two for head, two for width, and two for leg. Now I'm gonna click in Edit Poly, select Vertex. Now in front view and adjust on the, the view to model this point and this point. Okay. Using select uh, Vertex mode. The basic idea is get the shape using the box and grabbing the box and modeling the basic shape of the alien head. Now you can see now getting the, the face. In four views you can see all around the, the shape and modeling vertex and adjusting with using the scale. Uh, well, you have you can see now the the head, almost the almost the head, the alien head. Now, and using uh, polygon mode, set in polygon mode to extrude to create in the neck. Remember, select right click the polygons, right click polygons, and extrude. Now I'm selecting vertex mode to come back again. Come back, selecting modeling the head. Remember, man, my English is not very well, but the funk, don't mind. It's just watch and enjoy the tutorial. By the way, this is my f second tutorial with voiceover. I try to very. Playing the things in my with my English, and it's not really good. But watch out this tutorial. So you can see now using just the modeling vertex, adjusting with the scale, we use the move. In the front view, you can now you can see more accurate the face and the alien. Okay. Just try the modeling the basic shapes around the six box. Okay, in the front view, and now you can see the inset. I'm gonna create modeling the eyes. And the forehead. And using this chamfer in this point, remember right click and click in chamfer. Now you and now I'm creating the a part of the eyes. Now clicking inset. Sorry, this is just let's go back again. Well, in surface view now starting. Seems like an alien, like an alien heart. It's the basic shape of those. Now I'm trying to recreate in the nose, only the nose and the mouth. Remember the aliens, aliens they have a mouth, so you know. It's a tiny mouth you can see very well. I'm fixing the this area. You can see the the eyes coming out. Okay. Right. 
Now I select the polygons and use move, the rectangle tool move, remember in keyboard press W and now you have move. I might play the scene to see if everything is okay. Mm, certainly yes. Now I'm using the each so the latent. But I I'm gonna fix this because I no I need uh, some expression here, so I must delete that part you know, to create expression. You now you can see my the expression because of the anger or the mystery in the, the eyes. You know. You will see it. I try to remove this part to create uh, this expression. There, there is a, I removed that edge and I cut it. Now you have the eyes. You, know, you can see the anger or the mystery of the what the hell the expression. Okay. Let's push back the eyes. Now on the nose, right click and it's true. A little bit. Let's view. Uh, rotating the polygons so we have with the alien This part is, is called the facetted head because no, it's very smooth, not very fine and delicate. Just modulate the basic shape to get the smooth part. Okay. Now I select the, the vertex mode to Get the expression. The expression is everything in this, in this tutorial. It's everything. Now, uh, around the head, you, you can model everything. You can play around and make great things. But the expression is the key to this tutorial. Right now, uh, I made that I insert. Now it's true. With uh, people, I try to use if the Jedi clip. But I can't now. I use the the keyboard and the panel to create exactly, exactly, exact expressions for the eyelashes. So why? Very well. There you go. Now watch this. This is the funky part. I like it like that. Right. Creating the the egg 
the egg shape of the oval spring, the oval head. Just suggest to get the the right piece to to start. So you can check check out my new tutorials and 